Thank you, Last Concorda. Well, last Concorda, last week Sinn Féin looked across the water to Westminster, to a parliament that they take their expenses from but not their seats. They saw mayhem, they saw chaos and they saw dysfunctionality and they said, how can we get some of that over here? <laughs> it seems to me, it seems to me that's the reason, that's the reason for the discussion this evening. Because respectfully, Las Concorla, respectfully, Las Concorla, this motion does nothing, does nothing for the people we're here to represent. It is true, it is true that our country and our citizens are facing many challenges. But the best way to address those challenges is to ensure that we have a strong economy with the necessary resources so we can make interventions when they are needed, just as we proved during the pandemic. And it's because of the policies that this government has pursued that we're in a position to introduce a progressive budget and further supports to address the cost of living crisis. We now have two and a half million people employed, more than that was employed before the pandemic. And just today, Enterprise Ireland announced the highest recorded growth ever. Irish businesses creating jobs across every single county in this country. Our policies are working. And yes, we're in a three-party government. There are differences and there are times when we have to compromise. But where we are not compromising is in our collective determination to address the challenges facing society today. Mary Lou said they need 10 years, and tonight with others, others who ran away from the opportunity to serve in government are judging us Thank on you. two years. We, Fianna Fáil Thank and our collective you. partners Deputy in government did not run away. Thank we stood up to the challenge and we will deliver for this country.